Hello everyone and welcome to this mixed episode. Mixed because I'm going to show you the performance of the wheel in several games. So let's get started. I will start with Assetto Corsa because it is uh, recommended by uh, most of my viewers. I will choose this Nissan Laurel and this Hexor Mod Hill Zone suggested by Source Paths. So let's start and do some drifting. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I failed here a little bit, but uh, as you can see, I can maneuver with the wheel easily now. So that was some drifting in Assetto Corsa, moving on to the next game. Okay, now in, the, in a new game, which is Beam NG, and uh, I got the chance to get the Drift play Playground. It is the same map as in Assetto Corsa. Okay, uh, let's of course uh, choose a drift car. I downloaded this one. It's a very nice little car for drifting. Uh, eventually I'm doing super fine now. I've been practicing a little bit Not to lie to you because this game It requires practice and uh, Concentration See and I gave it more gas than usual. Oh Yeah, it was about to spin out <laughs> Very nice game indeed. Oh, oh well. Okay, let's uh, jump to a real scenario. This uh, checkpoint is a nice one. Okay, in this game you need to cross as many checkpoints as you can before the time runs out. And you need to be careful from the traffic. Right? We're still in the same zone. I think this way. Oops. I think I'm going away from the checkpoints. 
Oh, 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 oh no, 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 no. Oh my gosh, I'm stuck. Yeah, and it will. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's do some off road. Thanks. Yeah, I need to be easy on the gas because it is in low gear, so. And then slowly, so we can climb these blocks. Oops. There, I can select here high gear. It will go faster on the straights. Uh, when we reach the rock stairs, okay, again in low. Oh, yeah, the first feedback in this game is very realistic. Oh my god. You can see the wheel, it's like, oh, shaking in my hands. Oh, wow. I almost flipped it backwards. <laughs> yeah, the immersive in the force feedback, it's amazing. Okay, easy. Yeah, I know there is a shortcut for this, but uh, I forgot it. And, uh, for later on, I will make sure that I... Oh my. Where am I going? Okay, I didn't took that checkpoint. Ah, okay, it's like... Uh, no, I need to go back. Oops. I hit something. <laughs> Yeah, on the way down is easier than the go up. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. What have I done? Ah. That's okay. It's just to show you a little bit of uh, BMNG. Moving on to the next game. So, our uh, favorite drifting game is Drift 21. Yeah, let's just go to a quick race and uh, do a quick demonstration. Single race or single mode. Uh, which car I didn't choose before? The 180SX. So yeah, that's okay. This is new. Oh, look at the big wing. Yeah, this color is nice. Okay. For uh, some viewers, they ask me, uh, they want to see the view from inside with the steering wheel and everything. So, here we go. A little spin out, and I put the smoke in maximum in the settings. Okay, we cut a little bit in the grass.
The Nissan is stubborn. <laughs> I think it's better on third gear. Oh, that's okay. I saved it. Oh, it was a tight one. Ah. <laughs> okay, let's try to concentrate more. Sure. I'll give you a good show. Much better now. Well, probably now the tires are more heated and worn out, so they will slip more and give us better angles. It's okay, that was fun, and uh, now the drifting is becoming easier with me because the speed uh, of the centering of the wheel, it, it helps too much with the counter steering while you are drifting. Moving on to the next game. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, SnowRunner, the game that I enjoy the most, now it's becoming on another level with this steering wheel. I'll just uh, customize a little, uh, not a little bit, fast the uh, the Hummer, and we can go out on the right. Yeah, I don't need snow condor, uh, no visuals. Uh, only, of course, here my uh, coffee cup and the Delta logo in the mirror. Of course, the view from inside. Here we go. And I use the mouse to look around if needed. Yeah, to drive from inside with the steering wheel with this awesome truck from uh, Iceberg. It really gives the game another taste and another level. Yeah, now it's like always in a different uh, challenge, the view from inside. Actually, why am I still on the Aston? I need to go off road. <laughs> Uh, okay, I missed a left turn. Yeah, there it is. Just to make sure. Yeah, okay. There we go. Yeah, 
also here you will. Uh, I was surprised there is a nice force feedback in this game. Yeah, now I can see where the road goes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Easy. Wait. But if I make it between the trees. Yeah. Oh my. <laughs> yeah, as I told you, now the challenge is becoming super hard. Oh my god. I flipped the trap. Uh oh. Sorry. Oh, I don't have the offline winch. Oh, come on. It's okay. Let's uh, I just uh, bring another guy. And help us with the rescue. Okay, let's continue our road adventure. Yeah, reset the view. Easy. Yeah, this uh, the speed of the centering of the wheel is amazing. Even in off-road, it will help you restore balance. Wow. The road is on the other side. <laughs> Come on. Okay. There's a tree. Okay, now I can go forward. Now you really feel it's like very dangerous. <laughs> yeah, when you view only the car from the outside, you don't really feel that danger. Uh, okay, let's try to cross. No gear. Oh, I yeah, I have uh, the off-road tires, not the mud, but uh, I don't think it should be a, a problem for the Hummer. Yeah, I'm probably here. It's a bit deep. It's okay. It was uh, just a demonstration. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, and I am impressed with the performance of this wheel. For sure, we will go later on in each game and uh, get in depth with the performance of this wheel. If you like this video, share the love and give it a thumbs up. And why not subscribe to the channel and turn on the little bell icon to get notified every time I release a new video. If you have any comments or questions, pop them below. Thanks for watching.